Ladies and gentlemen, it's your boys Zabali, your one-stop shop for K-pop and hip-hop. And today, today, we are checking out the latest comeback by the world's favorite virtual group. Man, look, listen, they're getting a lot of hate online. And I, I can see both sides of it, honestly. But we're going to check out their latest comeback. It's a group that y'all know as BAM. Okay? That is a group that is known as Mave. Right? I, I hope I'm saying that right. I just don't want to get it wrong. But Mave... Y'all know it is wrongfully called an AI group, but I did my research. I looked online. It is not an AI group. It is a, I guess you call it a virtual group because there are actual singers. There are actual, <clears throat> there are actual people doing the choreography. It's just that they're motion captured and they are 3D. They are mapped onto these 3D models. It's like when you go in a blender and you do the choreography in the blender and then you know you you export and you you know what I'm saying. But I didn't. I don't know a lot about this group, but uh, so, for, by happenstance, I managed to stumble upon Pandora, and, and I thought Pandora was a sick ass song. Like, if you told me that that was a KDA song, I'd be like, "Damn, that's a dope ass KDA song." But it's not KDA. It's Mave. Um, so I can understand. Like I said, I can see the arguments on both sides. Why it's this is a good thing and why it's a bad thing. Honestly, why is it a good thing? Because like you don't have to worry about. <laughs> you don't have to. It, you, honestly, this thing could be run infinitely as long as you get similar voices and stuff. But I, also on the other side, I can see. You know, um, you, you don't really, you can't really see the hard work because it is just 3D mapped. It is just motion capture, so you can't, you can't really connect to these people, these idols, these virtual idols, the same way you can connect to real ones. But I'm not all into that parasocial malarkey, bro. I just want, I'm just here to. I'm just here for the music, okay? That's the point I was trying to make. I'm just here for the music. That's what I'm about. You can have the most beautiful idols in the world, but if your music is trash, I'm not bumping your stuff, man. Okay? So. I listened to Pandora. I thought Pandora was dope, honestly. And I am here for the music. So let's check out the latest comeback. It's titled What's My Name. The title track is titled What's My Name. Let's get into it, bro. It's Mave. It's What's My Name. It's a ball. It's like comment. You know the only 60% of y'all subscribe to the YouTube channel. Before we get into Mave, before we get into What's My Name, hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that bell to get notifications whenever I post because it helps the channel grow and gives you the motivation to keep popping out videos for y'all. Man, bruh. And so without further ado, let's get into Maeve. Let's get into what's my name. What's my mother in name? Sorry. <laughs> let's go. All right, Maeve, what's my name? Um, shout out to the, the singers that sing. Shout out to the dancers that mocap for the 3D modelers, for the, for, the, for the actual performances. Shout out to them. Shout out to all the animators. Shout out to everyone doing the hard work. I just wish that we... we I wonder, always wonder why that these four, these four singers and the four dancers, or if they're the same people why these four just aren't debuting as a real group you know what i'm saying i think that is what i think that's where a lot of people's problems come like why can't you just debut them as an actual group but you know how the k-pop industry is they'll find any reason to not debut you so <laughs> let's get into it man what's my name was it sped up no okay oh, also i don't know anything about the group besides that i don't know any of the members names i don't know about any other their favorite colors <laughs> I don't know, man. giving virtual idols favorite colors and stuff, man. It's it's crazy. But anyways, sorry. Let's get back to the song. I don't know any of the members. I'm sorry. See, this is what I'm talking about. It sounds good. It actually sounds good. And I feel like the animation took a step up. You guys, you guys feel that? I feel like it took it already took a step up from Pandora. We're two seconds in. Guys, am I gonna become a Mave stan? Honestly, I I'm digging both of these songs already. Like it, it sounds KD, it sounds derivative of KDA, but is that really a bad thing, guys? Is that really a bad thing? Can I go brr? If you get that, I'm I'm gonna lose it, bro. on this rap what you know about it oh i like that oh this job is about to be so sick Who 
are you? That run was... Uh, 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 that was good as hell. My goodness! Okay, so I'm, I'm assuming that she's the rapper. She's dope. Hey, Miss Pigtails, you are dope. Oh, Pandora, right? That's the first title track. Did she break a San Francisco Giants top? What in the hell? <laughs> Listen, well, where's my hat? I'm, I, I, my favorite baseball team is the San Francisco Giants. This is nuts. What? It's a 2012 World Series champion at San Francisco Giants. What? So random, but okay. Do I have to stand Maeve now? This pre-chorus is actually so super, super dope. What you know about me? What you know about it? Yeah! What's my name? <laughs> the more okay now, now i guess okay i'm starting to get more annoyed but not for the not for what why not for what you're thinking Listen, this group, man. Oh my gosh, she's so good. Something to say. Speak up, speak up. Speak up, speak up. So are you ready? We can start it. Oh, this is what? Okay, here. Oh, crap. Let me go. Let me, let me go to back just to get the ending of this video. Here's what annoys me about this group, right? Here's what annoys me about this group. It's the fact that the singers are so talented that I, what, I don't know what the reason is. What the reason was that these three, that these four girls. Uh, didn't get a proper uh, four girls didn't get the proper day real life debut I don't know what the situation was they said we can debut you but you're you're gonna have to be in this metaverse you are gonna have to be a virtual idol I don't know what the process was but this just makes me feel bad for the four actual idols for the four actual singers for the actual dancers if they're different if they're the same people or if they're different people that makes eight I just feel bad because you can see the talent and I just want to support them, but like it feels weird supporting virtual idols. Listen, I know that there are real singers behind this, and I want to support those people so bad. There are real dancers behind behind this group, and I want to support them so bad. But instead, I get this virtual version of them. But like, I guess you just watch the video with your eyes closed. You just you just listen to the, you just listen to the music. Honestly, by like in a weird way, this kind of gets you to more to focus on the music itself. Which is K-pop even about the music? <laughs> is K-pop even about the music anymore? But 
it kind of gets you to focus more on the music in a way because you want to detach from this virtual idol uh, sh so bad that like I just want to listen to the music and if the music is good like I'll, I'll listen to a virtual idol group so be what the hell like the rapper Miss Pigtails I don't want to be so I'm not being disrespectful though. that's just all, all the, the only way I know her Pigtails she is so dope at rap hold on I'm just gonna find out her name right now I'm gonna go look up her name Okay, her name is Tyra. Tyra, if that's your if that's your real name, okay? Maybe we can go on a file and change some of the metadata and you'll be somebody else. <laughs> but Tyra is dope, bro. As, like, whoever is rapping for Tyra, she is dope as hell. And the vocalists, I'm gonna look up all four, I'm all four of their names. Marty, Zena, and CU. I'm just, I think Zena with the bangs. Yeah, Zena is fire. So is CU. And honestly, they're all really good. So shout out to the to the idols that are behind the scenes doing the singing, doing the dancing, and doing the rapping because they are so talented. Uh, I'm just not going to even talk. Uh, you, you guys want me to talk about the video, like about the about the animation? I think the animation was slightly better than Pandora. Did y'all get that? But honestly, I'm not here for the animation. I'm just here for the music. And we are two for freaking two. Pandora and now What's My Name are dope ass tracks, man. And at the end of the day for me, because I'm not all into that parasocial malarkey. I'm not here to follow every idol's every idol's move on Weverse and watch every single one of their lives translated and, and for hours and sit there hoping to get an interaction at a concert instead of actually enjoying the concert. I'm not one of them. I'm here to enjoy the music. And from this, I'm enjoying the music, man. Shout out to Pandora. Shout out to What's My Name. Shout out to Maid, man. And let's wrap it up and let's go to the outro, man. But that's just what I think. Let me know what y'all think down in the comments below. Did you love this track? Did you hate it? Why? Shout out to Anthony Fantano. What's my name? Oh my god, it's still stuck in my head. It, honestly, it's still stuck in my head. Which member stood out to you the most on this? Yeah, I'm gonna have to say either uh, whoever was doing the runs, I think it was CU or Zena, and the raps. So that was that was between uh Marty and Tyra. Tyra, Tyra's raps was Tyra's verses were really good. And I don't really know between CU or Zena yet. I'm gonna have to watch more, but they were dope as hell on the vocals, and they had that little run in the chorus. Their runs are and, and during the high notes all during the ending of the song, man. They are so good. The vocalists in this group are so good. I just wish we knew who they were. I guess that's me being parasocial, right? Is it am I being am I a contradiction? Anyways. <laughs> Uh, yeah, let me know y'all y'all thoughts about Maeve and uh, let me know if y'all are able to separate the fact that it's a virtual group and just listen to the music because I think I'm going to be able to do that. It's just going to be hard. To, and I wonder if we're ever going to get to that point where, I mean, but we've had, had Suni Miku, you know, we've had virtual idols forever. So this isn't even a new thing. It's just that I guess it's not a, that new of a thing in K-pop. I don't know. But as far as the music goes, listen, I'm, like I said, I'm, I'm beating a dead horse. That horse that I'm beating that I'm beating to death has died a thousand deaths, okay? That horse is super dead by now, but just know I'm here for the music and Pandora and now here, What's My Name? Disgusting, fire, bangers, instant ads to the playlist, man. Shout out to Maeve. I really hope one day, maybe maybe seven years from now when their e-contract, <laughs> when their program runs out, when they lose their license, that we find out the identities of the real people behind this group, because uh, that'd be dope. I just want to give real people their props. So also the animators, also the riggers, the people, the, the mocap people, shout out to them as well. And so, yeah, with all that being said, that was Maeve, that was What's My Name, that was Sabalan, and that was Like, Comment, and did you know the only 6% of y'all subscribe to the YouTube channel? Before y'all go into Pandora's box, before y'all go into the Maeve-averse, you know what I'm saying? Hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that bell to get notifications whenever I post because it helps the channel grow and gives you the motivation to keep popping out videos for y'all, bruh. So without further ado, sorry, further ado, but the video's over. In conclusion, yo, and I will catch y'all mother suckers in the next video. Peace.